Apps like NV Clean Install make it easier to customize and debloat the NVIDIA driver. But what if you want to install only the core drivers without apps like NV Clean Install? How would that work? You'll need 7-zip and the NVIDIA driver file. First, download and install the 7-zip app from the 7-zip website in the video description. Next, download the NVIDIA driver from the NVIDIA website. Once the driver's been downloaded, right click on the NVIDIA driver, go to show more options, go to 7-zip, and go to extract files. In the pop-up box of the screen, you'll see a checkbox followed by a directory where the files will be extracted to. To keep it simple, let's call the directory NVIDIA 551.52 desktop as it's the NVIDIA 551.52 driver we're using for desktop PCs. You'll need the following files and folders, display.driver, HD audio, Node.js, NVI2, BizX, PPC, EULA.txt, listdevices.txt, setup.cfg, setup.exe. Delete all other files and folders. Open setup.cfg with a text-based editor like Notepad. At the bottom of the setup.cfg file, you'll see three lines. Remove the highlighted lines in the video. Save the file, and this will restore the original NVIDIA setup app without GeForce experience. Next, go to the NVI2 folder and open presentations.cfg with a text-based editor like Notepad. Change the values for the following two lines and use two quotation marks where it states value equals quotation quotation. Once you've done that, save the file. This will remove ads from the installer. Now, let's run setup to complete the install process. That's it. The diploaded clean driver process has been completed. But what if you wanted to take it one step further? To prevent some driver telemetry data sent to NVIDIA, run the following command in PowerShell or Command Prompt as an administrator. I will put this in the video description. To restore the default setting, run the default setting. Again, this will be in the description. Check Task Scheduler to see if you see any entries referring to NVIDIA telemetry or NV telemetry. Since no NVIDIA telemetry tasks are listed, there's nothing to disable. If one was found, all you need to do is right click on that task and choose disable. If you're experiencing issues with HDMI, NVIDIA, high definition audio timeouts, drops, or sleep, open the Windows Registry Editor. Go to the search bar and type regedit, and then run it as an administrator. Go to the following location listed on the video and I'll also include it in the description. This location will take you to the audio driver section. The NVIDIA HD audio driver will be listed in one of the sub keys. In this example, if I go to key 0000, the driver description indicates NVIDIA high definition audio. Go to the power settings folder. We'll change each entry to eight zeros. Go to the conservative idle time entry and double click on it. Press the delete key once and then press zero once. This will make eight zeros. Repeat the same thing for idle power state and then for performance idle time. You should now have all three lines indicating eight zeros. Close the registry editor app. Settings will take effect when you restart your PC. If you want to enable MSI mode to reduce GPU latency, you can do this by downloading the MSI Utility V3 app. I'll include a link in the video description. Open the app as an administrator. We'll find the NVIDIA GPU. And if there is a check mark already in place in MSI, this means MSI is enabled. You'll also see this if the number is negative. Now, if no check mark is present, simply put a check mark in MSI and then hit apply. The settings will take effect either on restart or if you disable and re-enable your GPU. If you'd like to disable the HDCP 
for DRM content, you can do so by running the following command in PowerShell as administrator. I'll put that in the video description. To re-enable HDCP, run the command that restores the default setting, which is also in the description. These settings will take effect on reboot. If you want to disable the NVIDIA ANSEL overlay, go to File Explorer, then go to the C drive. Search for NV Camera Enable. The file will be found after a few moments in the C Windows System32 subfolders. Right click on the file and go to Properties. In the Row location, copy the path, then open Command Prompt as Administrator. Type CD space, then paste the location you just copied. Hit enter. Next, type NV camera enabled space off. Enter. Once you've done that, NVIDIA Ansel overlay will be turned off. Now, if you want to re enable it, simply type NV camera enable space on and that will re enable it. Now, if you're looking to use Shadowplay or GeForce Experience, then you're better off using NV Clean Install or the driver itself. If you choose to use the original NVIDIA driver, you can disable HDCP, the NVIDIA HD Audio Sleep Timeout, NVIDIA Ansel Overlay, and even enable MSI. But telemetry is required for GeForce Experience. If you require Shadowplay for your use, don't disable Ansel Overlay and don't disable telemetry. Of course, you can always use an app like NV Cleanstall to do this work for you, but in situations where, for whatever reason, the app doesn't work, this is a good, longer alternative to achieve the same result. If this video has helped you, consider giving it a like. If you have ideas on future videos, let me know in the comments. Subscribe and turn on the bell if you want to see future videos. Follow me on X and Twitch for updates. Have a great rest of your day, and I'll catch you later.